Hi, this is Tara, and welcome back to my channel. Okay, so I'm at work, hence the mask, because we have to have on that mask. Please excuse the um, gray hairs. I'm going to have chicken pot pie for lunch. But before I do that, what I'm going to do in a different light, in a different setting, and hopefully I have something to do it with. Hold on, let me put you on pause. Okay, I'm back. So, I have my Benefits Poreless Primer on my face. And I try not to wrinkle my forehead, okay, when I'm putting this primer on. Before I left the house this morning, I put on my um, Nivea Body Cream as a moisturizer on my face. And I realized I had y'all so close up so close up and so what i should have did i should have um went into the break room and put my food in the microwave all right so listen before i send this back i'm gonna try it one more time you have two, 14 days this is the el maquillage and 2 30. I hope nobody comes in this bathroom. And it's too dark. It is too dark for me. I'm trying it in a different light. And you see, I'm just putting that much on. I have a brush that I put it on with, but I'm going to use this sponge. fan now so y'all can see so y'all can really see it because to me it to me it's too dark and my daughter she said when I asked her what I had on what it looks like and I, you know what it's giving me a feeling a deja vu <laughs> Because I asked my daughter before, and I said it on the video, that I asked my daughter. So, <laughs> um, but I know this is my first time using this foundation, okay, in the bathroom at work. Because I just got it. It's kind of red, too. But not that red. Okay. Look, this is why I like this, this silicone sponge. I like the silicone sponge because it doesn't soak up our product. Okay, so I'm gonna put a little bit more. I just I didn't pump it, I just rubbed it off of here. Because I don't like a messy thing. Okay. I don't like a messy thing. Put some. I hope one y'all get in the shot because I'm used to sitting down while I'm doing this. And I really don't like to put my makeup on before I leave work, before I leave home, because of a simple fact. And I left my concealer at home too that matches this foundation. So, you guys, we have to wait five minutes, okay, five minutes to see, and this is what my sponge looked like. I was going to use this brush, but I said, no, let me use it the way that I would normally use it, and this is El Maquillage, and this is in the shade 230, 
in this light. It looks decent. It looks decent. But I don't know if it's me or what. Because eventually, if I end up looking, I'll, I'll be like, and I'm going to do this Julius Place Berries, and then I'm going to put on the lip, and I'm going to put you on hold and go in the break room. Okay, I'm back, and I'm in the break room because it's my lunch time now. You guys, I tried this Naked Manicure Jelly System Cure System. Naked Manicure Jelly Cure System. And it's affiliated with Zoya. It's a nail polish brand. Okay. All right. I tried this. And this is it. You know, I don't know if you all can really see it, but it has a nice shine. Um, some of the gel got on my cuticles and my skin a little bit, and I end up breaking that part off because it will start to lift, as they say. But this is my first time, and I did a great job, you know, on my first time. And this is the nail that I have the most problem with because it splits down this way. So I'm really hoping that that it will, um, you know, that it will help with that repair because it has a repair system. It has a repairing cream. It has a repairing serum first. It has a base coat. Then it has a jelly coat. And you can just wear it just like this clear if you want. And my nails aren't dirty. I just don't know where well, this one might be because I just dug in my bag to get something. Okay. Now, this is my problem hand. This is my right hand, so I had to use my left hand to polish. The pinky is fine. Okay. And you see... The pinky is fine. The ring finger right here, you see, is matte on this side. And then when I do this, you see shine. I don't know. I don't know if you all can really tell in the light, but on this side is matte. That's because the gel has come off on this side by itself. And then oh, on this one. On this one, the gel has come off right there. Um, this one is fine. And this one was fine. It's fine. So, of course, my thoughts, feelings, and opinion is, okay, let's um, go home and redo it. Okay, let's go home and redo it. Let's go home and redo it. And um, let's see how well it does. It could be user error. You know, like I said, it's my first time user error. So I'm not going to judge yet. And I think I left my eyebrow pencil at home. I think I left my eyebrow pencil at home, but I may see one. Okay, good. Hold on. Let me go check on my food. Okay, so this is the El Maquillage in 2.30. So my mother is a couple of shades darker than me. So, and this is, to me, it's like a shade too dark based on what I see. But if I put on too much, that's what you're going to get. Even with the 210, if I put on too much, it just wasn't going to be pretty. Okay. And so, this is the concealer right here that came with, came with this one. And finally, I probably can see in this light, this is number, shoot, I can't see in this light, 15, okay? And I kind of don't want to put the concealer on without really getting a good look at it. Oh, I almost turned the camera off. Okay. 
Oh. I'm sorry, y'all. I got my phone up in a concoction. Contraption. Let me say that. A concoction is probably something you would take or drink or eat. Hold on. Let me go check my food. I overcooked my pot pie. Look. Ooh, Jesus. Look. It's burnt. It's dry. The crust is unedible. Normally, normally what happens is Normally what happens is um, <laughs> um, I don't cook it enough normally. Oh, I about not seen because I don't want no problems. Okay. Mm -mm. Oh, Lord Jesus. Okay. 
Okay, so. <clears throat> Ooh. <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to take this concealer, which is, like I said, doing a perfect angle. Angle. Straight up under here. You see how you can barely, you can barely see it. And people normally do their eyes first. Before they put on their foundation. But I didn't want to get caught up. Trying to do brows. And then not have enough time. Doing my lunch to actually do my eye. I mean, do my foundation. If that makes sense. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Probably shouldn't raise it. Pay me to pay attention. Oh Lord, did I go humming again? Right? I mean, the concealer, I can't say nothing bad about it because it's during the perfect for the cleanup, you know? So the rest of the eye, right? Let me. I have to get right here, um, because, and I don't really need to do triangles up under here. And that's something new I just did. Look like I got my war paint on. So now, you know what have been what would have been nice. What would have been nice if I had kept up with my what my thing. Hold on. I'll use this. It would have been nice if I had kept up with my little blender.
because I always get dark like around my cheeks, up under my eyes, my nose. Please. That kind of helps clean it up too. Yes, I'm going to tap in right here. Not the only one that felt that way. <laughs> that was a private conversation. I'm just saying, I'm not the only one that felt that way. Just not saying. I better stop singing. <laughs> okay, so, um, I don't know what. Color. This is my berry, okay, by Juvia's. I had no intentions of wearing berry today. I had every intention of wearing brown. So, because this berry, and I don't have any other color palette, um, I don't know how to work with this. Um, these lighter colors, like for transition. I, I don't. Okay. Especially something like pink. I don't know how to do this and make it work. So this will be my first time. But I would prefer each palette. Like if I ever was to come up with a palette and be a, um, create my own palette. You know what I would do? Just saying. I would... Um, now, I'm going to go in here. Because I don't have my other set of brushes. It's probably in my bag. Um, I'm going to go in with this... dark color right here okay see that right there and then I'm going to do this eye the same way Okay, then I'm going to go in with this. Okay, so I went in with this darker brown. This is my transition. This is on my corners. And this is going to be 
this is almost like a copper pink looking color okay a copper pink looking color okay okay and I know this is not my best look. It's not my worst. But it's not my best either. I ain't gonna lie. Because I don't know how to quite use these colors yet. And one eye look like it's popping. And the other eye doesn't. And I don't understand why. Maybe it's the way that I'm sitting. I don't know. Kind of blend out work. <sighs> okay. So now we're going to take this brush. Okay. And we're going to take um, this. And maybe we're going to take this. And then mix a little this in with it. And we're just going to go in the crease. Okay, go in the crease. And I'm learning in that crease, baby, don't you hold that brush too hard or too tight. And don't hold it too close up towards the brushes, with your hands either, okay? I know it's going to look different. One's going to look different. And you do wish your wipe emotions. Okay. This one look better. To be honest. Than this one. But who cares? I'm... I'm gonna have on a mask, girl. I'm gonna have on a mask. Okay, let me hurry up because it's almost time to go back. And um, yeah, if my pot pie is dry, y'all. It's dried out. And you know, makeup can get bacteria and stuff in it. That's why I like to kind of leave as much as that um the original the original packaging. I like to leave as much as that in the box as possible. Okay, so at this point, you know, on my lips, because I'm wearing a mask, and that's the safest thing that I can wear. I have Bear, which I'm, I'm not even going to try. I have Holly Grove, and I have Raven. And then I have Private Party. Now, Raven, right now, at my fingertips, is the darkest I have. So, And I like it, but my favorite is Graveyard. And I think I just ordered some. I'm going to get her blush palette too. By the crayon case when it comes out. Because that's all the eyeshadow you need. It's like multi purpose. Okay. Okay, and I like to put my stuff back, and then, and <sighs> oh, you know what, you guys, I should have took this and went here. Mm. That's what I should have did. 
Okay, and then I'm gonna take my private party by the crayon case. And I also ordered um, Clean Kisses. I'm not quite sure what color that is. And this is a pink. Dang, yeah. didn't mean to do that. Cause I, I wanted the shape of the lip like that. Okay, and y'all know this is gonna dry, so <clears throat> when she come out with that um that palette on the eighth of August, <clears throat> that's gonna be back to school time for a lot of people, college students, everybody, okay. When she comes out with that palette, I'm making sure I save up money. I don't have enough pink up here like I like it, but that's okay. So tell me what you think. Again, this is the L Maquillage, and you guys have, I'm kind of having a love-hate relationship with it. <laughs> I need some honest opinion about it okay this is let me see okay so this is the light just from the phone okay right here okay if i move over okay i didn't put anything on my nose or I didn't try to do anything with that. Okay, thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Thumbs up my video. Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend um, about my channel. Let me know what you think. Um, make some suggestions. In this economy, I don't know how much I can do as far as purchasing and trying different products. Again, this eye turned out better than that one. <laughs> That's okay. I'm at work and I'm getting ready to put a mask on my face anyway. So, thanks for watching to the end. Bye.